October 25th, the day of substantive form. You're imaginative people, but unless you're forcing your dreams and ideas into physical reality, you're wasting your time. Additionally, though, you're a solid person. You're someone that others can lean on for support and trust without fear of being let down. Finding a career that will let you express your ideas is perfect for you. Art, literature, e e ecology? Is that what it was? Yes, ecology. And there's another one in there. Ooh, city planning, that one, yes. Jobs in these fields will help you manifest and realize the ideas you have floating around in that big old brain of yours. You hate chaos. You much prefer to be in control, to see control, to manifest control, to live by control, 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 control. Your strengths are that you're physical, substantial, and dependable. Your weaknesses are that you're overbearing, intolerant, and complacent. October 25th, you have a bad habit of ignoring symptoms and, and, what's the term? Uh, indications of bad health. And if you're doing these things, this is going to lead to, to chronic conditions just wearing you down. So if you're feeling a little off on the inside, go and take care of it. Long walks, light jogging or swimming are recommended either daily or a few times a week. But over strenuous exercise is not something you should do often. Unless you work up to it, you know, like very slowly build up to like being a marathon runner. But don't just start off being a marathon runner. It's going to be terrible for you. And look at you, you lucky ducks. What you need is a lot of sleep and regular sexual gratification. Terrific. Not like those people yesterday where they weren't allowed to have a lot of sex. You need a lot of sex. Well, just regular sex, and that's wonderful for you. Lucky you. Open your heart and let the sun shine in.